Good evening, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Can you hear me over there? Testing sound, one, two, one, two. Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Good evening. Hi there. Good evening. After a long, long, long vacation, we're finally back on track. We're finally back on business. I miss the class. I hope you miss the class too. It's very important to keep the connection going. So welcome, dear participants. I'm excited to practice our English with you. Let's get ready. Let's get ready. Um, let's do a little, a little, a little practice with the quantifiers we studied in the last session. Okay. We have questions with the quantifiers. Do you remember the forms of questions using the quantifiers? Yes. Uh, what is the question? Are there many or is there much? Okay, okay, very well, very well. That is for the just no questions, right? What is the what is the WH word question? How many? And how much? Correct. Okay. Can you make a question using how many? How many? Can you use, can you make a question using how many guys? You don't remember? You don't remember? For example, how many is used for countable nouns? Therefore, I can ask you a question like, how many members are there in your family? Patty? How many members are there in your family? Um, there are five members of my family. In my family. Excellent, Patrash. Excellent, excellent. There are five members. Good plural usage. Good plural usage. Okay. How about you guys? Any other participant? Can you give me your answer? There are five members in my family. There are five members in your family too? Just yeah. like Patricia's family? Yeah. That's nice. That's a coincidence, huh, Patricia? That's a coincidence. Okay. Somebody else? There are four members in my family. Four. Okay. That's a little smaller family, huh? Okay. Okay. Can you make another question using how many? Different than my question. How many hospitals are in your neighborhood? Are there, don't forget there. Are there in your neighborhood? Are there, okay. Yeah. Uh, how many hospitals are there in your neighborhood? I think maybe. Uh, in your neighborhood, maybe in my no. neighborhood, uh, there's no in your city, in my city. Yeah, that's best. That's yeah. best. Wait, Tanya says, good evening. I'm sorry, Mr. Khaled. I will not be able to participate. 
turn on the camera because I am in my job. All right, Tania Pamela, apuntado, Tania. Thank you for the information. <laughs> okay, another question using how many? I have one question. I have one question for you. How many pairs of shoes are there in your bedroom? Just in the bathroom? No, no. Um, pairs of shoes. Pairs of shoes. <laughs> How many pairs of shoes? There are seven pairs of shoes. Seven pairs. Seven pairs of shoes. Okay. Can you make a question using how many? How many? How many parks are there in your neighborhood? That's good. How many parks are there in your neighborhood? I like it. I like it. Thank you, Jessica. There's a car passing by. Okay. How many fry pan in your kitchen? How many fry pans are there? Are there in your kitchen? Repeat. Uh, okay. How many fry pan? Are there in your kitchen? Mm -hmm. En el caso de fry pan, lo vamos a ubicar en plural, ¿ok, Miss? Porque how many es plural. So, um, how many fry pans are there in the kitchen? Okay, I have a question. I have a question. How many pets are there in your house? There are none. I don't have pets. There are none. Oh, okay. What about you guys? I have 30. 30? 30 yes. pets? Yes. Um, hey, hey, the mosquitoes are... don't count. No. <laughs> it's rabbits. <gasps> rabbits. Yes. <laughs> you have rabbits as pets. Great. That's nice. That's interesting, Sandra. Thank you. Okay, let's switch. Questions with how much. Remember, how much can be for two things. Number one, um, you can use it for non-countable nouns. For example, milk. How much milk do you drink? Uh -huh. Or um, uh, you can use it also with money, with price. How much is this computer? How much is your house? Talking about price. Okay. So I have a question for you. How much water, how much water do you drink daily? Volunteers? Volunteers? Van a ven a caer. <laughs> Quantifiers. This is non countable. How much water? How do you say liters? Liters. Liters. I drink one liter. Liter. liter or liter? Liters. Liters. Uh, every day. Yes. Excellent. I drink one liter every day. That's a that's a good answer. Thank you. Somebody else? Teacher, I forgot to drink water and I drink very little. Uh oh, you drank very little water today. You need to yeah. drink more water. <laughs> it's healthy. It's healthy. Thank you. Thank you. It's your turn. Make a question with how much? 
How much sugar do you like in your coffee? Correct. How much sugar do you like in your coffee? Hmm. How much sugar? How would you answer that? Volunteers? How much sugar do you like in your coffee? Talking about coffee. Mm -hmm. I like one spoon. Sugar spoon. Okay. I want... I want sugar spoon. Um, well, yes, I like one sugar spoon in my coffee. That's it. Okay. Two sugar spoons, three sugar spoons. That's too much. Yes, you Katya, three sugar spoons. I like yes, my coffee good. with one and a half sugar spoon and one uh, spoon of um, creamer. Do you like creamer? Yes, I like to. And also a little piece of semita mialuda, right? It's That's delicious. The perfect combination. <laughs> <laughs> How much? Very healthy. Very healthy. Hey, how much exercise do you do every week? Uh -huh. How much exercise do you do every week? Uh -huh. I exercise twice a week. Okay, that's good. That's good. You exercise twice a week. Now, twice a week es correcto, aunque twice a week viene siendo como una frecuencia. Entonces, ahí quiero que te guíes más por los quantifiers. Remember the quantifiers? For example, a lot. Repeat, a lot. A lot. A little. A little. Much. 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 Or, or none. No, I do non exercise. <laughs> all right, all right. How much? Let's see. One more question by a volunteer using how much? How much money do you earn? <laughs> That's a private question. How much money do you have in your pocket in this moment? In this moment? I don't have much money. I don't have. <laughs> I don't have none. Yes, I don't have any. I don't have much money. Okay, so Jessica is saying that she has a little. I don't have much money, so she has a little. That's okay. That's perfect. Good information. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, um, how much? Let me see. Let me see. Okay, that's it. That's it. Bueno, chicos, gracias por la práctica. Thank you for the practice. Let's move on the book. I'm going to share my screen with you so we can start our interaction tonight. Um, let's see. Here it is. Ooh, here it is. This is objective number four. Please confirm, can you visualize my screen? Can you see it? You sure? Yeah. Yes. You yes. can. Okay, wonderful, wonderful. Um, now, let me see, um, Elizabeth, can you, can you hear me, Elizabeth? Hi. Hi, Elizabeth. Yes. Can you read Hi. for us the um, objective for tonight? What is tonight's objective? Uh, the ob object. Objective. Objective. Mm -hmm. In this lesson, in this season, participants will learn vocabulary for describing people. Correct, correct. And this is a very, very useful topic, guys. This is an this is an everyday topic. It's very common to describe people. It's very common to ask questions for description. 
So we're gonna learn a lot tonight about that. Please, if you have any question, let me know. Vocabulary for describing people. We're going to check a video. Now, when you describe, when you describe somebody, you can do it describing two factors. Number one, you can describe the person's appearance. Yeah, appearance. Repeat, appearance. Appearance. Appearance, appearance is the physical. Appearance. Appearance. Yeah, the physique. Okay, and including including the clothes, including any kind of um, accessory like glasses, like a necklace, okay, hair, skin color. Okay, so appearance and personality. Okay, these are the two things you can describe: appearance and personality. Now, when you describe a person or or a place, you need to use adjectives. <gasps> so you have to know vocabulary, a lot of vocabulary to describe appearance and different vocabulary to describe personality of a person, okay? So let's check it out. Right now, we're gonna talk about appearance. Repeat, appearance. 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 Take notes. If you have a question, let me know after the video. Let's go. Hi, welcome to section nine. In this section, you will learn vocabulary to describe people. Look at the following pictures and repeat the adjectives of appearance after me. Hair, long brown hair. Repeat hair. 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 Repeat. Hair. 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 Long brown hair. Long brown hair. Repeat long brown. Long brown brown. Please, please note. Note. Oh my God. Quien me ayuda con su audio, por favor? No sé quién es. Who's that? Thank you. Oh. Hey, um... Okay. Guys, notice the order. There is an order for everything. ¿Cómo dice ahí? Long, brown, Brown. Long. 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 What is long? Brown. What is long? Hair. Largo. 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 We're talking about shape. Repeat. Shape. 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 Okay, so shape. Shape, shape is la forma. Okay. Por favor, chicos, please. Um, shape is la forma. Puede ser. Long hair, it could be short hair, yeah. It can be wavy hair, etc. So the shape goes in the first place. Bueno, la forma iría entonces en el primer lugar. Okay. Después de eso, ¿qué dice? Color. Color. That's right color you add the hair's color okay so first the shape then color okay share one more time my screen got lost okay so here long brown hair So what we got here is the shape plus the color plus the noun. Plus the noun. ¿Cuál sería el noun en este caso? Hair. Hair. Right. Next. Short blonde hair. Repeat. Short blonde hair. Short blonde hair. Short 
blonde hair. Blonde. Short blonde hair. Blonde. Blonde. Short blonde hair. Repeat. Repeat. Long brown hair. Long brown hair. Short blonde hair. Short blonde hair. Look. Shape. Shape. Plus color. Plus noun. Okay, next. Straight black hair, curly red hair, bald. Okay, that was very fast. Yes. Repeat, straight. 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 This is a little tricky word. Straight. 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 Please remember the pronunciation and not only the pronunciation, but the spelling. Vamos a ver a uh, Sara Molina. Can you spell can you spell straight? How do you spell straight? S T R A E A G S T Okay, we struggle a little bit there, Sara. Um let me see. Jessica's gonna help with Jessica Melara. Are you there? Natalie Patricia, are you there? Yes. Okay, can you spell straight? I I, I spell S T R A I G H T. That's right. Straight. Repeat. Straight. 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 No me digan straight, straight teacher. No, no lleva e. No me, no me lean ahí, no me pongan otra e. Solo es la s. Straight. Straight. Así comienza. Straight. Straight. Usted dice straight. 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 What is the meaning? Liso. Lacio. Lacio. Así se dice también, verdad? Um, straight. Repeat, straight black hair. Straight, straight, straight black, black hair. hair. Okay. Straight black hair. This is curly. 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 La chica que tiene perrito, por favor, me pone silencio. No podrías activar tu micrófono por la interferencia. Okay. Curly. 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 Creo que estamos teniendo mucha interferencia con el audio, chicos. Me ayudan, por favor, los que están en la calle, los que van en camino, los que no están en casita, me ayudan con su audio para que los que sí están en casita puedan tener calidad de audio. Please. Curly. 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 Pónganle ahí, papá caliente. Curly, curly. Curly no. Es cur curly. 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 Okay. curly. Red. Curly. Red. Red. Hair. 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 Marvelous. Marvelous. Okay. Curly. Red. Hair. Curly. Red. Hair. Bald. Bald. My little bald. 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 Carlos, how do you spell bald? B-A-L-D. That's right. Okay. Bald. Hey, guys, all of these are descriptions of hair. Okay. And what is the conjugation? You're going to say... She has, right? She has long brown, brown hair. In this case, she has, she has short, 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 short blonde hair. hair. Short, long hair. In this case, she has, 
She has three What about here? He has curly red hair. Now here is different. He has. He is bald. He is bald. He is bald. Yes. He is bald, like teacher Kalem. <laughs> okay, repeat. A mustache. A mustache. A mustache. A mustache and a beard. Repeat. A mustache. A mustache. Let me bajo esto. One second. One second, please. Here we go. Okay. Okay, repeat. A mustache. A mustache. A mustache. A mustache. mustache. Bold. A mustache and a A mustache. A mustache. A mustache. A mustache. In a beard. A mustache. In a beard. Bold. Hair, straight black hair, curly red hair, bald, a mustache and a beard. Mm -hmm. A mustache, mustache, mustache. Ah, a mustache, mustache, and and beard, beard, mustache and beard, beard, and beard. Do you like do you like mustaches and and beards on on men? No. It depends. It depends. Just beard. Just beard. Okay. No mustache. It's a little spiny when, when kissing, huh? <laughs> no, some people like some people like mustaches. Some people like like both. Mustache and beers, right? So look at this pronunciation. A mustache. Repeat a mustache. A mustache. A mustache. And, and beard. And beard. beard. So he has. He has he a. He has a mustache. A mustache. And beard. And beard. Let's talk about H. 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 Remember the question. How old are you? Repeat. How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? Or. Or. What's your H? Yes. What's your age? Repeat. What's your age? What's your, what age? your age? Repeat. Young. 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 Mm. <laughs> Young. 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 Wait, Young. wait. John. John Young. is is my my uncle John. That's a person. John, my <laughs> uncle Juan. Right? Young. Be careful. Young. Yes, Jose Samuel. Young. It's only young. 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 Repeat. Young. I am. I am. I am. Young. I am. Young. 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 No. Don't. Young is the person. Right? Okay. Okay. Young. Repeat. Middle. 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 Tongue. Tongue up. Middle. 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 Elderly. 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 Again, talking about age, young, 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 young. middle age, young, middle age, elderly. Elderly. Okay, let's talk about looks for a man. Only for men, you say handsome. Yes. Only for men. Yes. You cannot say 
You cannot say Katya is handsome. No, that's not correct. Okay, it's clear? Yeah. It's clear? Okay. Yes. So handsome is only for men. Repeat handsome. 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 También puede ser como un cariño, ¿verdad? Hey, handsome. Right? In la familia, right? Tiene al papá, al hermano. Hey, good morning, handsome. Yes. So, repeat pretty. 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 Or pretty. 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 Yeah. Pretty, pretty is only and exclusively what? for women. All right? Yeah. You cannot say uh, Carlos is pretty. No, no, no. It's not correct, right? That's a no, no. Now, for both sexes, for men and for women, you can say good looking. Mm. Good looking is equals to attractive. Attractive. Yes? Good looking. Yes? Good looking. For example, she is good looking. Repeat, she is good looking. She is good, he looking. Is good looking. He is good looking. He is good looking. Good looking. Or they are. They are they good looking. They are good looking. They no cambia good nada. They are good looking. No, good looking is for both men and women. In plural and singular. Yes. Okay. Yes, todos estos no cambian porque son adjetivos. Sean plurals o singulares, no haces cambio porque son adjetivos. The so, verb change. The verb is different. The nouns are different. Okay. So let's talk about height. Repeat height. 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 The questions could be height. how high are you? Repeat. Height. How high are you? How high are you? How high are you? Me con su audio, por favor. How how high are you? Y rápido. How high are you? How high are you? Parece que estamos hablando chino, dicho. O o podemos decir what's your height? What's your height? Así es más fácil. What's your height? What's your height? What's your height? Height. 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 Yes. Height. Which means altura, right? Height. Okay, repeat short. 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 Fairly. 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 Short. Short. Fairly means algo. Fairly, algo. Entonces, entonces short es, es bajito. Fairly short. Esta palabra fairly es para agregar como algo, right? Para modificar el adjetivo. Fairly short. Fairly short. Fairly short. Medium. Medium. Medium height. Medium, medium height. height. Medium, medium height. Medium height. Medium height. Medium height. Medium height. Medium height. Close your lips. Medium. Yes. Medium. Medium height. Medium height. Medium height. Ahora, pretty, pretty tall. Pretty tall. Pretty, pretty tall. tall. Teacher, pero pretty es para solo chicas. <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. Ah, sí, pero es que aquí pretty está como un adjetivo, ¿sí? No lo acompaña nada. Acá pretty lo antecede, ¿verdad? Bueno, procede un um, adjetivo acá. Tall. Entonces, si pretty está antes de un, de un adjetivo, pretty se convierte en un adverbio, que significa muy, correcto. Pretty tall. Pretty tall. Pretty tall. No pretty quiere decir tall. que bonita yeah. ni pretty. alto, ¿verdad? Ojo con, con ese uso de pretty es como pretty que tricky. Tall. Pretty tall. Entonces es pretty muy, tall. muy alto. Pretty tall. Y es similar con very. Very. Very tall. Everybody, repeat. Very tall. Very tall. Very tall. Very tall. He is very tall. He's very tall. 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 Very tall.
pretty tall. Pretty tall. Pretty tall. He is very pretty, pretty tall. tall. Yeah. He is pretty, pretty tall. tall. Medium height. Medium height. She's medium. She's medium height. She's medium height. She's medium height. Correct. He is fairly short. He is fairly short. He is fairly short. Short. Watch your dog. Repeat. Pretty. 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 Like the song, like the song. Pretty woman. You remember? Yeah. Pretty yeah. woman walking down the street. Pretty woman. Okay. Good looking. Repeat. Good looking. Good looking. Good looking. Handsome. 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 Elderly. 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 Middle Elderly. age. Middle age. Middle age. Young. 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 A mustache and beard. A mustache. A mustache and beard. And mustache and beard. Um, guys, este día sí hemos tenido muchas interferencias. Yes. Cuando voy a revisar quién es, todos ponen silencio, ¿verdad? Sí. No les digo, son tremendos. Pero... Vaya, entonces, chicos, me ayudan, por favor. O sea, pues, porque yo sé que muchos de ustedes están en casita de verdad, haciendo el esfuerzo. Entonces, necesito que nos apoyemos con eso en las interferencias. Please, es solo una hora, guys. It's just one hour. Hay que aprovecharla al máximo. Capich, me van a ayudar con eso, chicos, porfa. ¿Sí? Yes. Yeah. Please, yes. please. Teacher, I have a question. Dígame, tell me. Este, cuando nosotros no podemos decir a un bebé, what pretty? Mm, no, fíjese, mis, yo le sugiero usar otro, otro adjetivo porque pretty es para alguien que ya está, ¿verdad? Este, grandecito, ¿no? Ahí quizás aplica cute. Uh, cute. Mm. C-U-T-E. Okay. Porque es un baby, right? Todavía no puedo darle como que ese adjective. All right. Okay. Thank Any you. Any other question? My pleasure. Any other question? Yes, teacher. I have a question. Yes. Let's go. For example, how oh, this how describe no how do you describe the skin the persons very good question means very good question <clears throat> well in the skin there are different ways right uh, for example you can say for chelito you can say white skin. Yes? Yes. White skin, Chelito. Okay. How about, how about uh, piel oscura? Dark skin. Dark, D-A-R-K skin dark skin quiero ver si les encuentro algo por acá trigueño brunette let me see no this is too complicated let me see let me find you one skin color oh there it is Skin complexion. 
You can say, for example, light. Les voy a mandar este, este link. Hopefully, me dicen si lo pueden abrir, hopefully. Este lo pueden ustedes como que guardar aparte, right? So you can practice yourself. Let me see. Pongan una parte para que lo estudien mañana. Ahí está light skin, fair, medium, alive, tan, eh, bronceado, tan, brown, dark brown, black. Ahí están todos los skin colors. Okay. Let's continue with the video. Young, middle-aged, elderly, looks, handsome, good-looking, pretty, height, short, fairly short, medium height, pretty tall, very tall. Okay. So what are the questions? What are the questions when we describe somebody? How old are you? How does he like your height? Okay, 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 okay. Could be, could be. When when we ask a question, um, a simple question, you're gonna say what's. Quizás les voy a compartir un poquito acá mi notepad. Tomen nota, por favor, para que nos quede claro. Aquí está. There is a basic question, guys, and there is a very um, solid question. Okay. Let me share my screen. Can you see my screen? Yes. yes. Okay, so yeah. first. First, what's, what is, or the contraction, what's. He or she or it. Like, this is the basic question. This is the basic question, okay? <clears throat> for, for a person, you're gonna use a subject, you're gonna use a name. <clears throat> okay. For example, what's, What's uh, Jancy like? This is a very, this is a very basic question. I'm asking for a short description of Jancy. What can I say? I can say simply, she's nice. Repeat, she's nice. She's nice. She's nice. She's nice. She's nice. Nice. It's nice. It's, it's a, this is a simple question. So I'm giving a simple answer. Yeah. However, there is a more uh, complete question. What does, what does Sandra look like? Ooh, this is different. What does Sandra look like? Repeat, guys. What does Sandra look like? What does Sandra what look does like? Sandra what look does like? What does Sandra, Sandra, look, Sandra like? look like? That's the big. That's the big question. You need a complete description. Yeah. Aquí no puedo decir she's nice. No. You need no. to describe uh, age, height, and weight. 
Yeah. Mm -hmm. For example. Um, she's pretty. Mm -hmm. You're pretty, Sandra. Uh huh. ¿Qué más? She's pretty. Thank you. <laughs> I think she's tall. Yep. She's pretty and tall. Mm -hmm. Continue, guys. Continue. Model, she, Sandra. Model. She, Middle age. She, she Think so? Has, she how old, how old are you, Sandra? How old are you? I think 33 years. Oh, but Jessica it. dijo she's middle age. Is correct, Sandra? Or no? What? Is correct? You're middle aged? Mm. Or no? You are young, Sandra. Middle age is como, como que that podría ser middle age. I think 40. Yes. Es una edad adult, 40, adultez, um. ya, verdad? Madurez. <laughs> Madurita, miss. No. She's middle age. Okay. What about what about her eyes? What about her hair? Continue. She has black she hair. She has long black hair. She has. She, she has, has short. She black has hair. No, it's not short. It's not short. It's, it's long. Short. Long. It's short. Long. It's short. It's short. Oh. Bueno, yeah. que con las mujeres es complicado, eh, usted. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> short, long, I don't know. It's long. Yeah, I Digamos que es long. Short. Short. Black. Black? Black. It looks like black. I don't yeah. know if it's dark brown. Yes, black. it's black. Hair. Okay. Her eyes. What color are her eyes? Open your eyes. Open your, ya tiene sueño, pero open your eyes so much. <laughs> Her eyes. She has white skin. <laughs> her eye, Vamos con her eyes. Her eyes are black. Eyes. Black. 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 Yo que te digo blank. <laughs> her eyes. No, I say she she has white skin. Yeah, no yeah. White. And she has white skin. And she mm -hmm. has. Or yes, yes, mm -hmm. she has. No, she is. I'm sorry. She is white skin. So look, this is the description. This is this is a, a different description. This is look, this is a lot different. This description is a lot different because of the question. The question forces me to expand the information, but here is different. This is a simple question, okay? So, si solo le dicen what's el, el, el sujeto en like, no es gran cosa, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, what's El Salvador like? Uh -huh. What's El Salvador like? It's very like. Subject, subject. It's, it, it's, it's my favorite country. It's very interesting. That's it. Well, the map, it looks, yeah, okay. it's the map very it looks terrific. Soft. It's terrific. It's interesting. It's terrific. Yeah. Beautiful people. It has beautiful people, beautiful beaches. Okay. So this is for you to have a better idea about the descriptions. Let's move on. Let me go back to the book. There. We're going to keep studying about describing, okay, people. He says, we we'll listen to a conversation between two people describing another person. We're going to use adjectives of appearance. Hello to all. In this lesson, you will listen to a conversation between two people describing another person. 
adjectives of appearance will be practiced. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name's Ashley, and she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. <laughs> okay. In another person. Mm -hmm. Okay. Listen and repeat. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. I hear you I have, hear a, new you girlfriend, have Randy. a new girlfriend, Randy. I hear. I hear you have I a hear. new girlfriend, Randy. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name's Ashley, and she is gorgeous. Yes, her name is Gorgeous. 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 How do you spell gorgeous, class? G. O. R. G. E. O. R. G. O. U. S. It's the synonym of beautiful is the synonym of super handsome super handsome super beautiful yes. for example um, most of the celebrities are gorgeous Jessica Alba for example is gorgeous yes Shakira is gorgeous <laughs> Okay, repeat gorgeous. 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 Repeat gorgeous. really. Really? Really? What really? does she look like? What does she, what look, does like? she look like? What does 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 she look like? Well, she's very tall. Well, she's very tall. Well, she's very tall. Hmm. How tall? How tall? How tall? How tall? What's the interpretation? What's your interpretation? How tall? Mm, how ¿Qué tan alto? tall? ¿Qué tan alto? ¿Qué tan alta, verdad? Repeat. How tall? How, how tall? tall? How tall? About, approximately. About six feet two. About six, six feet, feet two. 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 I suppose. I suppose. I suppose. I suppose. That is tall. 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 What color is her hair? What color is her hair? Hair. 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 Her hair. 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 Excellent. Excellent. Hair. Her. Her. Hair. 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 She has beautiful red hair. She, she has, has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? 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 I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. She won't tell me. 
She, she won't, won't tell, tell, me. tell me. You know, ladies do not like to talk about the age. <laughs> so that's why Randy's girlfriend doesn't tell him her age. She won't tell me. You have any question about this conversation? No. Nope. No. Okay, cool. In that case, identify the nouns. Everybody, identify the nouns in the conversation. What is the first noun? What is the first, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, adjective, adjective. Identify for me the adjectives. New. George. New. Oh, yeah. Yes. Next. Georges. Georges. Gorgeous. Georges. Gorgeous. 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 Repeat. Gorgeous. 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 Next, next, next. Tall. Tall. What else? Tall. Hair. Hair is a noun. I know. Yeah. Yeah. Color. 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 Nope. Beautiful. 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 Yes. That's correct, red. guys. Good job. And red, red, the color red, yes, is an adjective. You're very intelligent. Let's practice the conversation. We only have three minutes. Teacher Kalev is going to be Emily. You guys are Randy. Ready? Yes. Okay. Hey, guys, I hear, I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes. Okay. Really? What does she look like? Well, well, well she's, she's very, very tall. tall. How tall? About, About six, six feet. feet. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Wow. That is tall. <laughs> What color is her hair? She has, she has very 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 hair. hair. And how old is she? I, I don't know. know. No, she, she, won't won't tell tell me. Me. she won't tell me. She won't tell me. <laughs> she won't tell me. Nice. Let's switch. Students start on three, two, one. Let's go. I, I hear you have your girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name is Ashley, and she's gorgeous. <laughs> really? really? What does she, what does she, she look, look like? like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? How tall? How tall? Well, about six feet two, I suppose. Wow. wow, that, 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 is, that, 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 that is, is so cool. What color is her hair? Um, she has beautiful red hair. And how and many how is, she? is she? That, I don't know. <laughs> she won't tell me. Okay, good job. I have a special homework for you. The special homework for you is what do you look like? Huh? What do you look like? And don't tell me I am very nice teacher. No, I need complete information, complete description. I need you to talk about your hair, about your eyes, about your skin color, about your age, your weight, everything. Everything, everything. So for tomorrow, you tell me your description, okay? Capiche? Capiche. All right, guys. Yes. Pueden bien estudiar los adjetivos. Váyanse ahí a Google y pongan ahí adjectives to describe appearance, okay? Y ahí les va a dar muchas más información. Thank you for your attention and your attendance you guys are great i will see you tomorrow at 8 p.m okay okay you. Bye. 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 good night see you tomorrow Bye. see you later alligators
Bye. Bye. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone. Bye. Practice your English. See you later. Bye-bye.